Doom. Well, Jason pop up, hit him with the. The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family 10 years ago tonight. 10 years ago tonight, huh? He ain't gonna get us. As soon as he won't hit him with that wop, bop, boo, dop, bop, bop, bam, boo. Look at him in that refrigerator. Come on in. Get out that refrigerator. Oh, dear. Bing. Oh. Rick? What is going on, everybody? Man, appreciate it for everybody that's coming through and checking this let's play of what remains of Edith Flinch. I think Edith, Edith, whatever. This game came out in 2017, but I'm gonna play it in 2021 because I never even heard of it. I don't know what kind of game this is. And if y'all hear this, y'all can hear that's water though. My ice, all my ice to melt it, man. But yeah, then we supposed to look around. What we supposed to do? I'm gonna put the cup down. Oh, 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 I want hidden. What are we supposed to be doing? We just ride on the back of the boat? Hold on, man, let me sit up. Cause every time I play again. Oh, who done died? Flip the page. A lot of this isn't going to make sense to you. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just gonna start at the beginning with the house. I also hope y'all don't hear my fan cause I sure got that whole blowing blowing directly on me. You lived there since it was 11 and have allowed in half the room? Why is it? Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago, marked urgent, open immediately. I was over with, I know y'all lights out. Seven years ago? Oh, nah, bruh. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Oh, so I don't blame you. I ain't mad at you. Go ahead, you know. I know my love for you. What do you In her will, my mother left me a key that didn't tell me what I'd unlocked. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. I'm confused. What is this, like the purge or something? Not the purge. Uh, What's that one movie? I can't even think of the name of it. It's like, the, not the conjuring. Uh... They was in the house and dude killed everybody. Even after I inherited the house. And this is based on a true story. I thought I'd come back to it. But now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Can we not run with you? The house have always been uncomfortably silent. As if they're really allowed to say something but never do. This ain't healthy. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. This ain't good. Why is that gold up so high? Either she's short or this gold is entirely up too high. The house was exactly like I remembered it. This a house? Dreaming about it. Oh, hell no. I know that at the top, boy, you get to stomping too little too hard, but everything, all that coming down. You ain't gonna tell me it ain't. Hey, girl, you been missing. Oh, that's Milton Flinch. What you do to Milton? As a child? The house made me uncomfortable in a way. Making me uncomfortable as an adult. Now, as a 17 year old, I knew exactly what those words were. She does a 26 year old making me uncomfortable. 
I hoped the key might unlock the front door. It didn't. If this house has been abandoned for seven years, don't go in there. Himself had been waiting for me. The key don't unlock the front door. It has to unlock the door in the back. Why would your mama give you a key and it don't unlock anything? She can't run or jump, so I'm assuming this ain't nothing gonna pop out and scare me. I don't like I said, I don't know what kind of game this is. Oh no, ain't no telling what's all in this house. The doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was eleven. Bro, ain't no telling what's all in this house. years. I felt like I was home. <laughs> but instead of a family, they were just memories of one. I mean, at least the dishes washed. Y'all didn't have some Chinese like food with that wonton soup. Would deliver to our house, so we had Chinese a lot. Y'all in Washington, Orcas Island? Is that a real spot? I'll look it up later when I edit this. Nothing in the I ain't house gonna look it up right now. There was just too much of it, like a smile with too many teeth. Yeah, too many books. Now y'all reading that damn much? After Milton disappeared, Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. Damn, Calvin only to be a living. Spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother, Calvin. I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Oh, I keep forgetting I got a dog. Oh. Turns out. My mom was really good at keeping secrets. Yeah, we can tell. Open the door! Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Mom and Pa was a freak. Ain't no telling what's all in here, man. Maybe it sounds like I had a plan. But Might I have had the only fans. Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. Quick fact, if nobody knows this, I'm going to tell you I just straight up. I used to be scared of owls. So I ain't going to lie, that kind of right there brought back a little trauma. December 13th, 1947. Oh my Dear God. Mary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving. So I looked around for something to eat. You finna eat your gerbil? The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Alright, whatever. Keep it going. Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart, it's late. Go to sleep. We hungry, man. We need something to eat. Bang on the door. Let her know. We need something to eat. I kept eating and eating. You finna eat toothpaste? Are oh, you a nasty little girl? Just, just jump out the window. I ate a lot of things that night. These ain't even real. You finna be eating straight styrofoam. Eat that bird. You hear that bird? Where that? Then I heard chirping outside my window. Kill that bird and eat him. There's a barn swallow going back to her nest. I reached out for her. Now I know why the cage bird sings. And suddenly, 
The hell you turned to a cat? What is this I'm playing? I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared. Well, you're a bird. Birds eat cats. I mean... I mean, cats eat birds. All right, there you go. Hell, what kind of freak ass game my plan? She can turn to a bird. Pounce on his head! Mom oh. and Dad didn't even look at me. I ain't ugly. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm supposed to get up there in this nest. What kind of weird sci-fi game am I playing? Oh. Oh, how about putting this chair? I could tell she was getting really tired. Now I was up in the big tree. I promised Dad I wouldn't climb it anymore. All I cared about was eating that mama bird. I got mm -hmm. her up. Oh, you finna die. And suddenly I was die. the owl. First. Oh, the then I heard little teeth nibbling. Uh, I mean, it's a good variety, to, you know, to add to the channel. But what am I playing? I can't even see. Come on, run into that. Woo! Woo! Hold on now. I hit. I hit. Swoop down and get your ego on, girl. Swoop down. Oh, hold on. Get that rabbit. I imagined his face looking up and seeing mine through my talons. I swallowed him up and I didn't chew one bit. Oh. Hold on, huh? I'll show you food. Wow. What the hell are you looking for? A rat? I mean, you are out now. Rabbit. There you go. Mama Rabbit, there she go. Swoop down! Get back here, Mama Rabbit! She was almost too big to carry. I started choking, but I couldn't stop eating. I'm gonna die. Suddenly, I was a shark! In a tree. You're a shark. No water. Why am I playing St. Rose when you have the destruction? This is exactly how this controls. I rolled off a cliff and into the ocean. Imagine being you seeing a, a shark. Oh, okay. Dun 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 dun. Let me stop playing. What are we looking for? What are we gonna eat? Some squid? Some fish? Hmm. I didn't even tell me I can dive down deep. Oh, they go one. Dun 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 Oh, yeah, get that seal. Bite him in the ass. I tore off her flipper and it tasted really good. I bet it did. Now go get the rest of that meat, man. Where'd she go? She should be bleeding. 
There she go. Whoa, 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 whoa. We missed. Hold on. Go back. Grabbed on tight. When I was so hungry, I jumped out of the water. When I opened my eyes, everything had changed. Who are you this time? A octopus? Now I was a monster and I smelled people everywhere. How oh, word? What's next, Godzilla? You know, technically, I wouldn't even be surprised at this point. We're telling the guys, I, I really want. That's the best thing about playing games you don't know nothing about, because you have no idea what you like. Technically, real quiet. Yeah. Ah! Like, technically, I think it's better to watch movies and don't watch the preview because the preview kind of gives away the movie. Like, you know certain scenes is going to happen, and if you haven't seen that one person in that scene, then you know you're not going to die or anything like that. I did it. I don't know what kind of monster we is, but uh. Get him! Last passenger, I was still hungry. What more do you want to eat? Something I had to have, so I swam towards it. Oh, all right. onto the sand, and the good smell went into an old pipe. I'm gonna eat the Ninja Turtles? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Did you come back to your house and you're gonna eat your parents? Bro, what in the world? I think she's back at her house. I gotta sneeze though. All my stomach started growling. And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time, but I couldn't hear anything. I think it's waiting for me to fall asleep. yourself I'm not sure if I believed all of that but I'm sure Edie would have well I believe it if you're gonna turn into a mouse too later, yeah, right but my mom never told me any of these stories. Edie would have, but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Though, when we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. I spent a lot of time in great grandma Edie's room. Her room was like a museum. For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune and misfortune. Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse, his wife Ingeborg and their newborn son, Johan. On January 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family and his house 
hoping to leave the curse behind. But 40-foot waves off the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Odin's daughter Edie, with husband Sven and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Oh, put this down then. We already went through all of them. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. Oh, I could have told you that. This installed the damn daughter. Edie knit me a new pair of gloves every year. Lewis died a week before we left, but Damn. we had already started to memorialize him. This is the house? When Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon, she could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. She could have, but she didn't. Even in her 90s. Sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. The only trace Grandpa's Why does your first wife Kay left on the house was the pink bathroom. And it's ugly as hell. It was a pretty big trace. There's a secret in this bathroom. There's a hammer in the cake. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. Sven gave Sven an old camera he'd refurbished. He never put it down. Hell, 1940s. Uh... It was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. I knew Grandpa Sam had a twin, and that he never talked about him. I guess my grandpa didn't like history any more than my mom did. How I Want to Remember My Brother by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, that was it. How are we swinging and we hurt? My brother okay, said he would die before he ate another mushroom, and he did. <laughs> hold on, bro, that's... He swore he'd never be afraid again, and he wasn't. I think Calvin always wanted to fly. You gonna fly over this damn cliff in a minute. Sam, Calvin, get on Jump, jump. But that day... Whoa. He finally made up his mind to do it. Jump! I'm trying to get enough speed so he can jump. Swing him up! Oh, I hit every button. You got to get out of here. Just stop swinging in. Stop swinging. Stop swinging. Stop swinging! You look better. Put your foot down on the ground. 
This fool here, man. Put the good foot in the ground and stop. Is this how y'all got y'all swings to stop? Cause I just used to put my, my foot down on the ground. I used to do backflips out of swings and some more. Okay, you can't press that button. What's the button do? That button do, okay. Why is he not getting out the swing? Don't worry about it since he, he can't get out the swing. I'm gonna make him go and jump on out. You finna jump over this cliff. Tell you, I used to be a professional swinger, man. Jump out! I told him going around was impossible. Maybe if I hadn't said that. You finna mess around and do something. Alvin, I'm not gonna tell you again. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up. Then maybe he'd still be here. Oh! But I doubt it. Hello. Hello, now we're getting... Get some altitude. We get a lot of it. Remember about my brother. Hold on now, Calvin. You get a little dangerous. Calvin, you gonna fall up the swing? We like it though. You wanted this. Stay on the swing. There you go. And he did. And I'm gonna make me share it too. Calvin's story felt strangely familiar. When I was younger, I remember trying to do the exact same thing. I ain't gonna lie, man. If all your family members dead, you still alive, get away from me. Obviously, you bad luck. Edie roped off Calvin's half of the room. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. Didn't we come this way at first, though? We did. Y'all got too much stuff in y'all room. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Command center. So I guess we gotta go back down. Oh, we gotta go over here? She got an eyebrows on fleek. Hmm, I'm still here. The passages were a pretty tight fit. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Yeah, that ain't for me. So this whole time I felt to go through Barbara, oh, I yeah. saw that and I always thought of Barbara the as a hell? child star. I never thought about how hard it must have been for her after. Being Barbara back and whoop her ass with this damn room in his dirty. Barbara's death, 
I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Old Jack here with another ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it the surprise ending of Barbara Finch. As a child star, Barbara was famous for her scream. Now at 16, she was all washed up. A has-been. But in a lucky break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. It was just a boost her career needed. Unfortunately, her scream hadn't aged well. <laughs> Getting better. I think you just need the right motivation. Her biggest fan and current boyfriend, Rick, was about to demonstrate when... <coughs> now that was a great scream. It was Barbara's father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Her convention comeback was canceled. <coughs> okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried... A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orca's Island tonight. Police are urging residents to... That came from the basement. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your basement door locked? Because my dad likes making puzzles and secret passages. There's a key hidden in the music box. The secret is to keep winding and winding until finally the key pops out. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in a sec. 20 minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. So Barbara went to look for him, right on cue. She reached for the music box. Uh, I'm pressing the buttons. And as she wound the key, she listened for Rick, but the house was silent. I know y'all hear this Jason music. And imagine the worst. When Jason pop up, hit him with the... The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. Ten years ago tonight, huh? He ain't gonna get us. Cause as soon as he wanna hit him with that wop, bop, boo, dop, bop, bop, bam, boom. Look at him in that refrigerator. Come on in. Get out that refrigerator. Oh, dear. Bing. Oh. Barb, relax. I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not scared, Rick. I'm furious. Then act furious. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and- She threw him out, but she kept a little something to remember him by. Barb, have you seen my other crutch? And she was still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. Hours later... Barbara! Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Okay, I'm coming up. But if this is a trick, you're dead, Walter. I need more ice. I don't think this is no trick this time. I like how this looks like a cartoon. Oh, it can't go that way. Don't... That hook man escaped. He ate his family 10 years ago. He gonna eat you too. That probably would've got me if I, you know, scared. It doesn't been a scary game. Walter, are you there? Bing! Walter vanished. But 
his bedside radio was still on. Orca's Island police describe the man as six feet tall with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. I returned, saw the hook man, and was speechless. He was quite smashing. <laughs> what was that? There's gotta be another way out of here. We in our boy room. Go through here. That night, she played her part beautifully. She thought about abandoning Walter, but just couldn't do it. So where are we supposed to go? Go through Molly door? Bust out, hit him with it. Bink! Hit him with it again. Oh yeah, he did. He wasn't moving, but she sensed the story might not be over yet. Yeah, watch when we get down here, he's gonna be gone. The hook man had vanished. She listened for his breathing, but all she heard was. She been getting hooked in the back of the damn head. I'm inside the house. Oh. Oh dear. Swing that crutch, girl. Bravo, Bravo. Bravo. The monsters had come to surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream. And she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. She was going to be famous. And with her final breath, Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. I wasn't there myself, but I hear Barbara was magnificent. Poor girl. She had a taste for stardom. But unfortunately, so did her fans. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick, who disappeared the same night. And little Walter? Hiding under his bed the whole time. He took it all pretty hard. But that's another story. As for Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Her ear. Now that's what I call a real eerie tale. Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered, as absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. I guess now I know why Mom didn't like me playing with the music box.
Wow, this whole time I've been talking, bro, and I've been mute. I'm so sorry. I'm so oh. I think I'm gonna do one more store. It was off limits, unless I wanted another tetanus shot. I'm gonna do one more store. I sneak down to the basement once, carrying packages. I do one more store, and I'm gonna cut this part off. It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. Not cut it off, but save it for another part because we're already pushing by what 45 minutes, 48 minutes. I remember asking mom once about where Walter had gone. She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as he could. If there's a pattern in all these stories, I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. Nah, that all y'all died. Hey, he lived the longest. Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. On that first day, after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive a week. Some of y'all don't even know how to after use this right here. Days, I settled into a routine. That's what kept me sane. Having a schedule, living for today. I always expected to be dead tomorrow. But if you wait long enough, you get used to anything. The years that went by in the calendar. Even a monster on the other side of the door starts to feel normal. Almost friendly. And then one day, everything just... Stop. Whatever that thing was, 17, 17 it was something. gone. Maybe I got tired of waiting. Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. It's been a week now. The longest in 30 years. I'm done waiting. I have to leave while well, I still can. Man, you've been waiting this long. You might well go on finishing on now. You've been down here 30-something 30, uh, 30 years. They will not let you run at all on this I know game. it's out there somewhere. Whatever killed Barbara. And Molly. And Calvin. Think it's gonna kill you too, man? Wise words from a decent man Maybe back when I was trying to put a ring stuff. on the leash in hand. This lost boy got fly without Peter Pan. But I need My delivery just got me buzzing day. like the pizza man. In person, yeah, I'm everything me. and more. Whatever's out there, I want you to know I'm ready for it. Shit, she's about what? I'm going to appreciate all of it. You're about 50 some years old. Especially up. the food. I don't mind if I only have a year left. Or a month. Or a single week. I'd be happy with one little day. I can already imagine the sun on my face. You just gonna stand in front. Walter died when I was six. I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. We're gonna pick the rest of this up. When I come back, cause his death was about my far the stupidest. Oh, you you died because of a train? A train? We we'll see y'all on part two. Hopefully, I get done with the whole part two. I don't know when it come out, but see y'all then, man. That just pissed me 